in the sky, gazing far into the night. I raise my Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Happy New Year, first of all. This is my first video for 2016 and I just would like to say sorry for not posting in a while. But I'd also like to say thank you so much for all the support that you guys have been giving me so far. Thank you for helping me grow my channel, it's really been fun. And I love all the support and all the comments and um, yeah, if you want to see how I got this look, please stay tuned. Okay, so first what I'm going to do is bronze up the skin. Um, what am I going to use? Okay, I'm going to use the Hula bronzer. So. So yeah, I had the most amazing holiday in Cape Town. I was with my boyfriend um, and we stayed in Heart Bay for two weeks. And yeah, we we were basically mainly on Camps Bay Beach the whole time. It was so beautiful, it's so beautiful there. I mean, I've been there before to visit my cousin once but I mean it was long ago and we stayed in a hotel so we didn't really go to you know the beach and everything or we were young then we didn't have a license so we couldn't really do that um yeah it was it's beautiful there if you're not from South Africa or even if you are from South Africa and you've never been to Cape Town Really go there. We went up Table Mountain. Oh, it was really nice. Then for a blush, I am going to be using this quite, it's quite a dark shade. It is the Rimmel Lasting Finish Soft Color Blush in Tuscany. Just dab lightly because it is quite pigmented and it's quite dark. But you are going for this bronze look. Very lightly. Okay, for eyes, I am going to just prep my eyes with the Painter D by MAC, the paper by MAC. I chopped my nails off if you haven't noticed. But it does, it is worth it. If that's the question you're asking. The whole inspiration about this look is this Rimmel eyeshadow. Look at this. It is so beautiful. So yeah, this is the whole inspiration behind this video. So I got this at Clicks. I think it was 95 bucks, if I'm not mistaken. Sorry, excuse me, okay. Um yeah, I think it was 95, but it's beautiful. It's such a beautiful colour. So what I'm gonna do first, I don't know if I'm gonna pack it first onto my lid. I think I'm gonna start with my crease. And what I'm gonna do today, I'm gonna use the same Tuscany blush and I'm gonna use that as my crease colour. If I need to go darker, I'll use a different shade, but this is basically so I'm gonna take this brush, the 217 brush by MAC. And I'm going to start applying that into my crease. Just like that. So yeah, I am just putting that into my crease and I think I know it's calling me. Same 
Now I'm just going to take this fluffy brush and just blend in what we've already done. Blended. Airplane! Okay, cool. So now we're gonna take this amazing color. I'm gonna use my finger. Just like that. And I'm gonna start packing it onto my lid. Okay, well with eyeshadows like these, you usually need a brush like this, just so you can lightly brush away the fallout without rubbing it into your skin. Brush away the fallout. Then what we're gonna do is gonna take this same this 224 brush, just to blend out the edges. I want this color to be a little bit more intense. I thought it was gonna be a little bit darker, you know. Maybe I should just take another brush. This is what I'm gonna do. I'm going to take another brush and I'm going to spray it with Fix Plus and I'm going to dab it into that colour just to make it a little bit more intense and I'm just going to go over my whole lid again that's better you see now we're seeing the colour a little bit more because I was looking for that foiled Effect now you can see it a lot better. It's much better. Much better. Much better. <laughs> so then we're gonna take a fluffer brush. I'm just gonna blend that in again. Just like that. And then we're gonna take that same pink and then highlight that you just went over. Perfect. I'm gonna take black track. Does someone have to use the weed eater now? Let me just close the window. So irritating! Okay. Wing liner. Let's do this. That looks pretty good, don't you think? It's going to tend to part. What's the time? I need to hurry. Okay, that one's done. Practice makes perfect. Then on to the second one. Good to me. Just wanna make this a little bit thicker, yeah. And we didn't mess up. We didn't mess. <laughs> Thank goodness they're the same because even though you've done it hundreds of millions of times, it can happen. And cool. Before I do my mascara, I am going to highlight. 
And today I think I am going to use this. I am going to use this LA Girl Blush Collection palette in Spice. There are two blushes and a bronzer and a highlighter. This is, this is actually what I took to me. Took to me. Took with me to Cape Town. It's quite nice. It's got my. It's got your bronzer, your blush, something. There's two different brushes and your highlighter. So I thought it was flipping good because it's everything in one. So what I'm doing, I'm just taking the highlighter and I'm going to start highlighting. These palettes are so affordable. I think this palette was 60 Rand. Like, hello, a disc game. And the quality is actually really good. I use the, high, um, the concealers from LA Girl. I do contouring and highlighting with that. Maybe I should do a video like that. that out of it and I'm going to take the same highlighter and put it on the inner corner awesome. cool so now for mascara I'm going to try a new mascara today this is by Rimmel as well this is the wake me up wonderful mascara it says that it has what with vitamins and cucumber. Ooh. I thought it said more, but it was just in French or something. So I'm gonna try this. The one looks like this. You can see properly, I don't know. And this is what the bottle looks like. I'll just show you properly. So let's try. I actually like the formula. I can see that I'm gonna have to do two coats because I'm offering lashes to falsies today. So I'm gonna have to put two coats on. But I really like the formula. It's not too dry, but it's not too wet. So like, if it's too wet, you know, a mascara can just drag your eyelashes down. Just let that dry. This really is, are you joking? So that's three coats with this mascara to get it the way I like it. But I do like it, I must admit. Oh, that's the top lashes. The bottom. Sorry if I'm cutting out as long as you can see my eye. And someone wants to buy me. Cool. And that's it for the eyes. I like this mascara actually. It's just you need to put a, a few coats. Okay, for lipstick, I am not wearing a lip liner today. I am going to use the Rimmel London Apocalypse. <laughs> this is in the shade. It's a very good question. 101 Celestial. Too bright, yes, no? I think it looks nice. That's what it looks like. I think it looks perfect. A beautiful color wow beautiful so that's the final look i really hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial please give me a thumbs up if you like this video and subscribe to my channel see you next time bye